Warning, the hidden camera stunts in the show are performed by trained professionals. Do not try this at home. You think the targets are biting today? I hope we're using the right kind of bait. Here, target, target, here, target. Oh, I think we've got a live one. Huh. Let's, Let's walk, walk the, the prank. prank. Meet Joanna. We've hired her to be our camp counselor for the day and help us on a fishing trip at sea. So this is the monitor we can watch the, the, the fish as they migrate and stuff like that. But the monitor is really a fake with animated graphics we created. So Joanna's going to think that whatever she sees on the monitor is right under us in the water. Now, while Joanna is distracted, Bailey trades places with our stunt double. So a school going over the left side. And... Looks like the fish are jumping today. But we're interested in one particular fish. That must be something big right there. Oh, wow. Yeah. I've never seen a fish that big. It's like a shark or a whale shark or something like that. That's about the size of a boat. This is not safe. Yeah, get the kids. Yeah. I'm going to get the kids in the back. You get the kids in the front. You have to move away from the water. Get out the water. Oh. 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 What happened? What happened? What happened? What happened? What happened? Ah. I don't know what happened. What happened? No, I didn't push her. Did you push her? Did you push her? No, I didn't. I didn't. I didn't. I didn't. I don't know what just happened. What, what you just walked the prank. You're on a hidden camera prank TV show. <laughs> you were yeah. I didn't even notice it was the girl. <laughs> I thought you were going to get bit by like a shark or I don't know what it was. So I'm like, oh, somebody come get her, please. I just walked the prank. Yeah. 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 Yeah, awesome. On the last episode of Walk the Prank. I can no longer be keeper of everyone's secrets. Oh, what yes. secrets? Chance is going to leave Walk the Prank to join another prank group. Bailey has a crush on Herman. And Uncle Will has been secretly dating Bailey's mom for the last year. Wow. I actually feel a lot better now. I'll see you guys at the joke shop. You! I told you that stuff in private. Those were secrets. Don't blame me. You're the ones who blabbed to a blabbermouth. A blabbermouth can't be blamed for blabbing. I had to blab it forward. Will, you have been secretly dating my mother for a year? I love her. <laughs> Good luck texting Ann now. I can't get in. You changed my passcode, and it's in Chinese. <laughs> Give Uncle Will a break, Bailey. You can't help who you love. Like how you're hopelessly in love with Herman. I do not love Herman. I said I have a teeny tiny crush on him. Can you guys please take your non-pizza eating negativity elsewhere? I like to eat my pizza in silence. Honestly, I think she took that pretty well. Hey, Bales. What's up, Boo? What you doing? Reading how to crush your enemies and make them suffer. Stop, Bailey. I, I never said I was going to join Pudgy Pete's channel. All I said was that I was thinking about it. Chance Baldwin! Pudgy Pete! Whoa! It's actually them! And he knows your full name! Which means he knows half of my full name. Hey, Tudor and I are just cruising through to see if you want to go down to the boardwalk and smash some P ranks with us right now. Yeah, dude. Pranking isn't a hobby. It's straight up a lifestyle. And this game's 24-7, 365. Because I'll sleep when I'm dead and body while I'm alive! <laughs> I can roll with you guys. That's what's up. <laughs> to the tutor mobile, my dude. <laughs> Just to uh, let you know, Bailey, I would never disappear on you like that. I wish you would disappear. I'm going to do an amazing magic trick. I'm going to make Chance disappear. Really? Boobina bee. Ba -ba -da -ba. Bam! Let's walk the prank. Meet Brianna. She thinks she's here to watch over three boys tonight. Me, Herman, and our other brother, Michael. So I got three kids. So uh, that's the family right there. Chance, Herman, and Michael. They probably want to play with this thing over here. I just made this for them. They want to do some magic and stuff like that. So uh, yeah. So now that Brianna knows all about the family, time to take her up to Herman's bedroom and introduce her to us. Hey, guys, this is uh, Brianna. Herman, Chance. Nice to meet you. Hey, can we show the magic box? Yeah, sure. Downstairs. I was telling a little bit about it. 
So now Uncle Will tells Brianna that he built our magic disappearing box from some instructions we found in the attic, left behind by an old magician who used to live in this house. Just finished it today? No, 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 no. There's no trap door. OK. Magic's real. OK. So Will leaves, and the real magic begins. Yo, guys, do you want to take a selfie? Wait, What's up? get down, get down. Awesome. Okay. So now that we've got that selfie, Herman has a secret for Brianna. Come with me. I want to show you something. Do you believe in dark magic? I found this. You got to keep a secret from my dad. I didn't want to show him because it's about like dark magic and stuff. These notes were here in the box downstairs. So look at this. This is the disappearing thing, which I think goes with the uh, disappearing box downstairs. I'm going to disappear. You want to show me that? Will you let us do it? I mean, I guess. Cool. Oh, you're going to regret that, Brianna. Now let the disappearing act begin. I'll see you on the other side. See you, Hermione. Now for the first part of our act, I'm going to recite a bunch of complete gibberish and make Herman disappear. Ta-da! So we all know Herman is under the trap door, right? Now it's time to bring him back. To Estelagato Sunt Fruit. Whoa, well, that wasn't supposed to happen. OK, and here's Herman. Come on, Herman. He's, he's supposed to be in here under the trap door. Herman? Is he not in there? No, Brianna. He's long gone. Because while we were doing our disappearing act, he actually crawled through a special trap door we made that goes behind the wall. Now the question is, can we convince her that he actually did disappear? First, I'd translate what I just chanted. Wiped from Earth, you never were. Wiped from Earth, you never were. He's probably hiding in the backyard or something. So while I take her outside in the backyard on a wild goose chase looking for Herman, Herman! Our crew is inside doing some rearranging, removing every piece of evidence in the entire house that Herman ever existed. They take down the magic box, then they switch out every family photo, so now I only have one brother. Michael. And they turn Herman's bedroom into Uncle Will's library. We already made Brianna believe Herman disappeared. Now let's see if we can make her believe that he never even existed. He might be in his room. Uh. Now I'm going to act like I'm forgetting who Herman is and the fact that there ever was a magic box in the living room. What? Brianna was already confused. But we're about to make her feel like she's going crazy. Is there something missing? What are you doing? What? I don't know what you're doing. Summer salts, but. No, the box. What box? The box that was just right there. I don't know what you're talking about. It's weird. She's totally freaked. Wait till she goes upstairs to Herman's room. I mean, Will's library. She's getting worried, and it's only gonna get worse when Will comes home and we pretend that Herman never existed. She says I have another brother. Herman? Who? Herman Where? was doing his magic trick. Who? Herman. How many sons do you have? Two. Michael and Chance. Michael, Herman, and Chance. Speaking of pictures, remember that selfie we took earlier? Herman was in that one for sure. Wasn't he? Everything was going normal. She she came in, we took a selfie, and okay, then... Wait, wait, look at the selfie. If he's gone, I'm going to freak out. Oh, my... Tell me, tell me what's happening. Michael's upstairs, correct? Yeah. Uh, please tell me what's happening. What's going on? Now let's watch Brianna try to retrace her steps. That's for you. OK. I walked in the door. She said, hi. I have three sons, Chance and Michael and Herman. Nope, still the same picture, Brianna. Okay. Uh, I went upstairs. Right. And then you showed me Herman's room. No, no, this is my library. Wrong again, Brianna. There's no Herman. So now we tell her that we're going to take her home. But she just can't let it go. OK, so like magic is real, right? I think. I don't know. And he did a disappearing act. And now his brother's gone and like erased from your memory. And I'm not crazy. OK, we're going to look into that. Well, we've made her believe that magic is actually real. Oh, and Brianna, one more thing before you go. You just walked the prank. You're on a hidden camera prank show. You're a prank show, and you're not crazy. You're alive! You're alive! Oh my God.
<laughs> See, Dad, I told you he was real. I thought that I was in an alternate universe. I don't even know what was going on. My brain is mush now. Thank you. I just walked the plane. <laughs> yeah. Awesome. Yeah. Bye. Bailey, unlock my phone. I've tried every passcode I can think of. How many combos can there be? 10,000. Oh, hi, Billy Bug. Mom, <laughs> what? Why is she here? <laughs> Gross, don't hold hands. <gasps> Bailey, baby, I, look, I'm sorry that we didn't tell you sooner. And you know, I would never do anything to intentionally upset you. And that's why I can't be in a relationship that upsets my little Bailey Bug. Oh, thank goodness. Unless the relationship is going somewhere serious. What? We're, We're getting, getting married! married. <laughs> <laughs> Look at this rock! Coming up next on Walk the Prank. No one is leaving here tonight! Warning, the hidden camera stunts in this show are performed by trained professionals. Do not try this at home. In this next prank, we've given the target a mission. Land this bottle on a table. Oh! Yay! Their next mission, explain why they destroyed our classroom. Let's, Let's walk, walk the prank. prank. Meet Stephanie. She's here to be our substitute teacher before the big science fair. Do you want to try one? Yeah. Wait, what is it? Do you want it? a bottle flip? So you go like that, but I'm actually to land make it. it. Keep in mind, we're playing bottle toss right next to our precious science projects. Guys, I am so sorry. You tossed too hard. Oh what did you do God. to it? What was that? I, hi, sir. I threw the bottle here, and then it that tossed one table. One table tossed the other table. The other table tossed the other table. Did you try to destroy the projects? No, sir. I didn't. I. Guys, do you know what this means? No science fair. No. Oh. No. Oh. Oh. That means no advanced science. No. And that's going to affect your college no, grades. No, no, no. Sir, it wasn't intentional. That's right, why I didn't right. want to throw anything, though. Unfortunately, what was intentional is that you just walked the prank. You're on a hidden oh. camera. Oh. <laughs> I feel so bad. <laughs> I just walked the prank. Yeah. I knew. I knew. I knew. Great job. Who's the target today? I don't know. Whatever sorry lame ends up walking by. Oh, man, my bicycle's broken, and I was supposed to deliver some food to my sick grandmama. Hey, you need some help? Yes, uh, thank you so much. You can start by helping me figure out what those ugly shoes are. What are those? What? what? Ah. <laughs> You're a jerk. That's how we do it on the Punch Patrol. Be sure to smash that subscription button, peep the merch, and remember, it's 24-7, 365. Because we'll sleep when we're dead and party when we're alive. <laughs> and clear. So what'd you think? I don't know. It seems super mean. How is that mean? You dumped a milkshake on that guy's shoes. Bro, we're gonna get like 20 million views. I'm bringing joy to millions of people. I just think that your guys' old pranks were more fun. Nah, fun and laughter were my old brand. Now we're more into social experiments, disrupting society by straight up ruining people's days. <laughs> hey, Pudgy Pete. There's an old lady power walking this way. Oh, oh, quick, give me another milkshake. Let's go. <laughs> oh, look who it is, Mr. I'm Too Good for Walk the Prank. I never said that. Yeah, how was your date with Pudgy Pete, you backstabber? Really, Uncle Will? You're one to talk about going on dates and stabbing your friend in the back. Yeah, good point. Thank you, Herman. Well, well, well. Look at the little lovebirds sticking up for each other. We're not lovebirds. Yeah, we're love humans. Respect our human love. What? No one's going to respect no that. Sex, I took off the so many times. Hey, guys. Friends. I have something to show you in the basement. I'm tired of all this bickering and arguing, so I'm locking all you guys in here until you're friends again. No, Dusty! Open the door right now! What's going on? Since we don't know how long we're gonna be down here, may I have this dance? Dusty! 
Let me out of here! Um, Bailey, I was wondering if you might want to, you know, um, dance with me at uh, some point. No. OK. Well, what if we prank to Target? I thought you'd never ask. Let's walk the prank! Welcome to the first annual Walk the Prank Fall Dance, a fun shindig for all the kids in school. And here comes our target now. Matt, nice to meet you. Meet Matt. He thinks he's been hired to help chaperone the school dance tonight. But in reality, he's about to find out that one of the kids at this dance is not like the others. But first, he meets Will. Thank you for helping us yeah, out, man. I'm sorry I'm losing time. my voice, bro. No worries. I've been yelling at these kids all week, oh, man. No. So, yeah, yeah, yeah. And now it's time to put Matt to work, serving punch and mingling with the kids. Hey, how's it going? Would you like a little, a little punch? You look very nice. Oh, good. Yeah, there we go. Wow, Matt's having a great time and making lots of friends. Hey, there we go, guys. Okay, all right, we got so it. So let's yeah. introduce Matt to Herman and that strange girl, Bailey. Hi, Hello. I want some punch. Oh, okay, we can. I, uh, I got. No, plenty. I was actually in front. I was actually in front. I asked oh, very nicely. No, no, okay, no, 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 no. I was in front. That's okay, guys. Okay. Hey, no, it's like... You are making me very angry, Herman. Okay. Yeah. Please? Okay, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Thank you. So now Herman comes back to set Matt straight about Bailey. I'm really sorry about that. Yeah. She's kind of. Crazy, and she's really weird. She's uh, I've uh, seen her move stuff with her mind. Wait, what? I've actually seen her move stuff with her mind. No, I'm serious. She like... She's like super intense. Like it's like really freaky. She's literally like a witch. So just don't get on her bad side. Like I'm serious. All right. Yeah. Yeah. If you think she's weird now, you ain't seen nothing yet. But first, it's time to crown our king and queen. And guess who's going to make the announcement? The king and queen, the winners this year, Bailey Schuster and Sam Cohen. What do you know? Scary, angry Bailey won. So now Matt crowns our king and queen, and Bailey gives a speech. Hi, guys. I'm Bailey. I am so excited to have one. In the past, I have felt like you guys didn't like me very much, and you were kind of mean to me. And as a result, I was kind of mean back, I guess. But the fact that I won shows that you guys all voted for me and that we're all friends, I guess. I'm going to be nicer to you guys and not as angry. Now that Bailey's cheered up, unfortunately for Matt, we're about to tell him that there's been a mistake. I apologize, but I made a mistake. Sam is the one, but it's Jessica. I thought that I, I was supposed to count. It's Jessica. It's Sam and Jessica. Do you, can we can we just tell him just before before it goes too far? Just announce the uh, Jessica. Uh oh, Bailey is not gonna be happy. This is an amazing night. Something tells me this isn't gonna go well. Thank you guys Sorry. so much. Um. Hey guys. <laughs> Sorry. Um. It's a little, I guess, I guess there was, was a, a bit of a mix-up with the winnings. It was like a just recount, no just, 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 just on, on the queen. queen. So, so um, the actual winner is Jessica Hart. And now it's time for Matt to find out just how angry Bailey can get. Just 
Walk the Prank. You're on a hidden camera prank show. <laughs> scale of one to really scared, I'm, I'm pretty, pretty dang scared. <laughs> when she moved the drummer, I was like, oh, man, it's over. I got to go. <laughs> I just walked the prank. <laughs> Look, can we all just say we're sorry so we can get out of here? No, Chance, because what you did actually hurt. I'm not joining Pudgy Pete. What? Why? It just felt wrong. Well, that's nice to hear. Just so you know, Bailey, I was never mad at you for being madly in love with me. <laughs> <laughs> well, while we're all admitting things, my totally illogical and disgustingly embarrassing crush isn't going away. Yes! I knew it! People are gonna be so excited! Hey, look at this meme I just made of us getting married. Wait, did you just call a meme a meme? Yeah, a meme. Flip your hair. I feel nothing. I feel nothing! Woo, that did it! I cannot believe that you just called a meme a meme. My crush is officially cured. So since we're all admitting things and forgiving everyone and happy, happy, blah, blah, we're good now, right, Bailey? When are you and Anne getting married? July. Great. That gives me five months to scare you away from my family. Bring it on. Dusty, Dusty we're, we're friends, friends again. again.